Welcome to the show. I'm your host Sandman. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Multi-Pick Jackknife Everyday Carry Pocket Pick Set Exclusive Orange Line Edition plus their brand new 10 tips and their expansion Jiggler Key Set. Let's get into it. So first off, Multi-Pick reached out to me and said, hey Sandman, we actually have a huge sale coming up that is going to go from March 28th all the way through April 14th. And we are gonna have over 250 products on sale. Specifically, we also have a few new items in stock and we're going to mail one of these to you. If you would like to review it, let us know. And that is the Orange Line edition of their jackknife tool. And I said, yes, please, because I am addicted to things that are orange. It is the dumbest addiction in the world. I don't even I don't even want to really go down that road. It's so stupid, but I'll, we'll talk about that here in a second. But let's talk about the new tool. Let's talk about the new tool. And that new tool is basically they have this like it's literally in my top three favorites, if not top two. I love this thing. This is tier one all the way. I love this jackknife tool. I've did a whole like I don't know thirty minute review on this thing. This is wonderful. Like really, really top tier, best best in class. Like it's amazing. And then they came out with this orange line version, which has completely different tips. This previous one that I have reviewed in the past actually has more traditional tools, profiles among its assortments. So we have an S rake, a city rake or L rake, um, a kinetic rake or a W rake or whatever you want to call that. Um, then I would have a, a, a traditional half diamond, and just a rounded lifter pick here. And I do have the expansion pick. Actually, I missed one here, a double uh, a half ball, or double, or excuse me, a half snowman for those wafer locks. And I, there is an expansion kit that comes with that. I have a really great review on that. Just check that out in the search uh, bar of my website. But this is completely different, completely new. This thing, not only does it come with 10 uh, optional expansion tools, and you could probably buy the traditional 10 expansion tools separately to add to this. But this guy comes with a very nice, I think this is called, I don't think this is called a thin, but it has a nice little cutout here. Um, I, I don't, man, I hope you can see that. It has a nice little cutout there uh, for that rounded medium hook. And then we have the Lock Noobs version of a Bogotol. And then we have an, a Peterson style gym, and they call this a facet, which happens to be my favorite profile of all the thousands of profiles that I have. And then we have a double diamond, which is really great, I think, for people that are picking either wafer locks, double-sided wafer locks, or if you, um, you may just be one of those pickers that in interacts as in, the, uh, in the field and you see locks that are right side up and upside down, pin stack, pin stack on top, pin stack on the bottom. You don't have to flip this thing around and feel uncomfortable picking it. You can just keep doing what you're doing. And then we have this guy. This is like a little turning tool for disc locks. That's how it's advertised. I'm gonna go out a little bit further here and say, you know what you should use this for? You should modify this tip so that way you can make your own uh, favorite lock pick. That's what I would use it for. And then we have a super cool decoder. This is what I would, I mean, this thing's not too thin that it's going to break under pressure. I guarantee I could probably use this for um, not only just decoding, uh, combination locks and realtor locks, push button uh, combination locks, but I would probably easily get away with uh, hitting that master 175 uh, with this, which is a combination master lock, very common here in North America. So that's super cool. Uh, I, I'm super happy for that. Let's go ahead and get into the review here and let's talk about the product before I talk about everything here that is orange. And so we have the Jackknife Everyday Carry Pocket Pick Set Exclusive Orange Line Edition plus 10 tips. This normally retails for 55 euros, but it's currently on sale for 49 euros. Um, for British sterling pounds, it is 48, but it is now on sale for 42. And that's including the VAT, um, the value added tax. But if you are in North America and you want to purchase this guy, um, it normally retails for 60, excuse me, $51 because we don't pay a VAT here in North America. So $51 or for this sale, $46.20 before shipping. That's pretty good. Um, if you are interested in this, I am 
Currently, I do have like a little coupon code that I can give you. I get nothing in return for this. They give me nothing in return. They give me product to review. I get to keep the product, you know, after I review it, that's all I get. But then they're like, hey, how about we reward some of your followers, give them 10% discount code one time up to eight items in a shopping cart. And that is multi pick YouTube sand one zero M P Y T sand one zero. That's Mike Papa Yankee Tango Sierra Alpha November Delta one zero for saving 10%. All right, the original multi-pick jackknife pick set in a new everyday carry version. Small, handy, functional. We have further refined and improved our globally popular tool with new pick tips that you will only find here. Always at hand. For instance, the letter box key has been lost or an emergency situation in which access to a locked object is required or geocaching tour that requires a locked container to be opened. I like that. I never even considered that. Then comes our... TMP to the rescue. Always at hand. For instance, the letterbox key, or excuse me, I just read that. The everyday carry pick sets contain a selection of different types of pick tips for different types of locking mechanisms. The casings of our TMPs are made from milled block of aluminum. So the body of this is aluminum, making it super light, which are anodized finished with a special micro finish, a real eye catcher for some clever functions and weighing just 26 grams. The individual picks are made of German high grade steel, which is extremely tough, but still offers the necessary flexibility. The milled metal body provides very high levels of tensional rigidity when picking locks. All picks and the integrated tensioner have been modified for picking in particular narrow keyways. The gauge of the picks measures 0.5 millimeters. Wow, that's, so that's I think 0.5 millimeters is around about 19 thousandths, 19 and a half thousand, I pretty, believe that is. I'm sure I'm wrong and somebody's gonna yell at me in the comments, go, Sam, man, that's not right. I'm sorry, I'm doing my best here. But let's move on. The integrated tensioner can be removed with a slight push and reinsert it again easily, equally easily. The individual picks are locked in place using a knurled screw on the top of the tool. A secure hold of the picks is therefore 100% guaranteed. With a very low net weight, this results in a sensitive picking process with a very firm grip. I can tell you right now, you want something lightweight. You don't want something bulk. You don't want something bulky and huge. You don't want something heavy. And, you know, you don't want something that's just going to weigh you down while you're picking. I mean, I have all of the best jackknives. I have over 13 of them now. And I really love the form factor in this. I love the chassis. I love the white lightweight design. I love the profiles. And I love the pick steel. I really love it all. A secure hold of the picks is there for 100% guaranteed with a very low weight. This results in a sensitive picking process with a very firm grip. Another advantage of our development is the ability to change the pick tips with a very short time. Within a very short time, all you have to do is loosen an Allen screw to a millimeter. With the optionally available pick tips, you can put together your own customized pick kits. Be it your, for yourself as a gift for geocaching or for emergency services in all kinds of sectors, the original jackknife pick set from Multipick is simply a safe companion for any situation. This pocket knife pick set comes with the following picks. The hook five, the lock noob, a boner rake, the facet short medium hook. That's like that Peterson gym style that I love so much. The full diamond large, the disc turner, which I would recommend you use that as an opportunity to customize your own tool. And we have an ultra decoder. The following pick needles are included in this set. So this does come with an expansion set for that low price that we mentioned. So it's gonna come with 10 more tools. So we have a jackknife tool. We have a double ball, a diamond again. We have a Bogota. Uh, we have a, a, man, so these are very specific here. So let me talk. We have a lock noob drurium and a monith rake. And then we have a cycloid wave rake. So this is going to be the cycloid. And then one of these is going to be the monith and the drurium. I apologize, lock noob. I love your stuff. I just don't have your, your tools memorized. He designed those. He's smarter than me. He knows what he's doing. All right, this is a very good short flat, flat hook. I love that. I like this uh, medium flat hook. Oh, 
snap, and they have a deep, flat hook. They did a really good job on that. We have an extractor here. We have a very low-profile half diamond. We have a double half diamond for those double-sided uh, uh, wafer locks, and then we have an actual jackknife tool. They call it the shank. That man, they really thought of everything for this expansion kit. And you don't have, obviously you're not gonna be able to fit all of these tools in there. You pick what you like. Personally, with this bottom of uh, Keyway Tensor, I am probably gonna fill this thing with just rakes and maybe one pick, like a short hook, and just move on with my life and call it perfect. Because I think it doesn't get much better than that. Or maybe I'll go with that Peterson style gem. I don't know, I have so many options here and I haven't decided which one to do. So the length is 89 millimeters, max height is 19.5 millimeters, the width is 6.6 .6 millimeters, and it comes in at 26 grams. Uh, I think that's what that is. So for successful lock picking practice, our practice locks offer a wide range of options for learning lock picking and are developing or improving your skills. Let's move on with this. Let's first off, I want to talk about the turning tool. This is a very unique jackknife in the sense that the turning tool um, is, I, I don't have any other, I have 13 jackknives and none of them assemble or disassemble this way. So the jackknife tool just assembles like this, like that. So I'm just going to take, I don't wanna pull on this thing. That's not gonna get me anywhere. Uh, it's a friction fit. So I'm just gonna push up, slide my thumb up like that. There we go. I like that it's taken me a while to pull this out and I'm just being an idiot. Maybe I put it in wrong, but that's what's gonna happen is it's just going to slide out like that. There we go, I wasn't pushing hard enough. So you just wanna push forward and slide out Kind of like maybe you're scratching a niche or something, and that's how it comes out. Friction fix, I like that. I don't have a problem with it. I've been carrying the black one for a while, and I've never seen it come loose. I think it's great. One thing to notice is a lot of these companies, um, I have a lot of other companies here that, uh, let's see, I got one here from Southern Specialties. I got one from UK Lock Pickers. I got the Dangerfield one, which is the same thing. I have Lock Master here. I have the Mad Bobs. Oh man, I have so many. I got the Sparrows. I've got the Martin Newton, I've got the Majestic, and I've got the Swick, and I've got the Covert, uh, no, the Covert Companion and the Slim Pickens, and then I just have the Riv Pick by itself. I have so many of these things. The only one on the market that actually uses a magnet to hold these tools in place so they don't flop around in your pocket, and then it also has a nice friction fit right there. They're not going anywhere. It's a really great um, idea that they're utilizing those magnets that nobody else has uh, keyed in on just yet. Nobody else is using those magnets. So that that's something I find very impressive. So we have so much to offer here. Oh, also it comes with this lanyard. If I wanna put this on a key ring, or maybe I wanna attach it to my pack, or maybe my belt loop and I don't wanna lose it, it, does come with that lanyard there. And then we have, let's see here, okay, we do have an Allen wrench here for changing out those tools. And then they, this particular one they sent me does come with the uh, the expanded, um, this is this is uh, Jiggler keys. I don't think this is actually in this particular set. I think this is purchased separately. But these Jiggler keys are very unique. I haven't seen these yet at being offered from Multipick and I'm looking forward to trying these. You know what these would be really good on aside from wafer lock and just normal residential style pin tumbler locks? These would be really great for, I would say, wafer door locks. Specifically, these would be really great for glove compartments and these would be really great for gas, uh, gas doors, like the gas, where your gas cap is for filling gasoline in your vehicle. If I'm stranded and I'm out of gas, maybe I gotta walk around, I may, maybe I might find another vehicle that, that's possibly out there and I wanna unlock that gas cap so I can siphon some gas because I'm in an emergency situation. Maybe that's what I would do it for. But these jiggler keys, are very traditional, very iconic, and I have a couple uh, non-traditional ones in here that I see that I've never seen before. I'm looking forward to playing around with those, and I, I have a lot of, uh, I think those are gonna be great for automotive locks. So let me talk about why I love orange really quick, and we'll end this video. So I got a story to tell you. I, I went through the Pathfinder Survival School, the uh, basic uh, uh, Pathfinder course uh, under Dave Canterbury and uh, Sean Kelly of Corporal's Corner, and, and my instructor for that uh, three-day course was the gray bearded green beret and I had a friend that I only did the basic course I had a friend that went on to do the intermediate and the advanced and became a certified instructor and he was telling me a quick story he was telling me he was doing the advanced portion in the at iron decks up in uh, upstate New York and he was uh, I believe that's where the at iron decks are but it's like this uh, large mountainous region 
that's in uh, New England area. And it was it was like a snow course where they had three feet of snow everywhere and they had to survive for three days in that nonsense. And it was, you know, like five degrees below zero and all this other nonsense. He lost his knife on like the second day. He lost his knife and he needed that knife. Uh, I have a, where did my knife go? Oh, it's in my lap. So he lost his knife on like the second day and he couldn't do like 90% of the chores that needed to be done without a partner. So he went through the whole process with his partner and the gray bearded green beret, Josh Inyard said, Hey man, you did great, but you probably wouldn't have survived without your knife. He goes, I'm going to pass you if you can find your knife and you you finished the course. I am going to graduate you if on the way, if, if you can find your knife at the end of the course. So this guy was looking for like six hours and the coldest weather. And finally he was about to give up and he's walking back to his car, having spent a thousand dollars on the course and gear and all this other stuff in three days, just suffering in this cold. And he comes across his knife. He was able to see his knife in the snow because it had red scales. It had red G10 scales on it, red handles. And he told me, he goes, I will never ever carry something to the woods that's not bright colored, not bright red or bright orange. He goes, when you lose something and your life depends on it, it, it just, the color means more than everything. And it's beyond the cool factor. You need practicality. That's what it's all about. And this guy was so much better than me at survival. I took that to heart and I was like, gotcha, Roger that. I'm going to invest. And so I purchased, you know, my $300 LT Wright custom uh, knife here uh, from LT Wright Knives. And I got it engraved with my name. And then, um, you know, I've, I've, I've got the uh, the silky saw. I've got all the Exotax stuff. I've got the, the, you know, the Leatherman, limited edition Leatherman. I've got the, uh, you know, power bank and I've got the Olight and Streamlight and all kinds of crazy stuff. And, you know, just anything that I can find that's orange, I buy it, man. I even have the $600 um, Brunton, you know, surveyor uh, compass that's made and built aluminum. Like, this is the nicest compass that money can buy. I'm not trying to brag about the stuff I spent my money on because, um, you know, um, I just, everybody has a credit card and I'm just really stupid with mine. Um, what I'm trying to say is I absolutely appreciate that the third color that they decide to offer, I think they had one in blue, red, and black, so maybe this is the fourth color. Um, I love that they went with high visibility orange. There is such a necessity for covert entry tools and high visibility, high visibility orange. I'm not going to give my position away. I'm not a sniper, but I do want to be able to carry this when I'm bushcrafting, going camping, and I'm going out into the woods. This is going to be really great for my vehicle kit. Um, I'm going to 100% put it in my camping kit. You never know if you're going off-roading and you're in your vehicle, an ATV or four-wheeling, and then somebody decides to play a prank, or maybe they're just being absent-minded, or maybe they're being mean, and they're, they're going to close a gate behind you, and you're stuck out on a trail miles away from everybody. How are you going to get your vehicle out of there. You sure as heck don't want to leave your vehicle and try to traipse through 20 miles of rough terrain on foot. Anything could happen. So what do you do? You pull out your multi-pick everyday carry jackknife tool and you open up that sucker and you move to safety. So this is going in my everyday carry kit for camping. I absolutely love that they sent it to me. Thank you multi-pick for sending it to me. If you are interested in this tool, don't forget your 10% discount code. I don't really have anything else to add to this. I hope you guys like my stories. I collect so much stuff that's high visibility orange fan everything from my cover to my containers this is the only my container is the only thing this titanium uh grail water filter is the only thing that's not orange i really if they do make one in orange i am gonna go out and buy it but i collect so much dumb stuff in orange i even have my notebook in orange i love it i love it thank you so much multi pick for sending this to me for review thank you all so much for watching and i'll catch you guys next time Mr. Sandman, bring us